Hello guys, this is Sal and welcome to my channel. In this video I'll be showing you how to speed up your Windows 11, optimize it for gaming and performance, which will therefore help you to increase your FPS and fix shuttering and lag in games. So let's begin. So for fix one, you'll have to go to your settings first. You can open settings from the start menu. After opening your settings, you'll have to click on Windows Update. Over here, you'll have to click on Check for Updates and it will check for the updates. You'll have to make sure all the latest updates are installed so that you can keep your PC running smoothly. As you can see, there are a few updates pending for me and I'll, I'll restart my PC later to install them. For Fix 2, you'll have to open your Task Manager. To open your task manager, you'll have to click on the Ctrl, Shift and Escape key all together. After opening the task manager, you'll have to click on the startup option on the top. These are some processes which automatically turn on when you turn on your PC. You can disable some of these options which you don't require to decrease the boot time of your PC and this will increase the performance of your PC you'll have to open your control panel and set your PC to high performance mode to do so you'll have to first of all open your control panel I have the control panel on the desktop if you don't have it on your desktop you can just open run to open run click on the Windows logo and R together over here you can type in control panel and hit enter as you can see the control panel has now opened. You will have to type in power options on the search bar on the top. Click on power options. Over here as you can see there's two options over here. I made the custom option gaming for myself. But if you want the high performance option and you don't have one you can create one over here. Create a power plan. If you have one you can just select it from here. So create a power plan and then click on high performance. You can even give it your name, whatever name you want. And then click on next. Create. As you can see I have just created my custom plan. High performance mode will give you better performance. But if you are not plugged in it may also cost you more battery life. So keep that in mind too. For fix 4 you'll have to delete your temporary files. Temporary files are those files which are needed to run software or programs. After using those programs you can clear them up and free some space. This will actually improve some of the performance of a PC. To clear those temporary files you'll have to open run. And to open run click on the windows key and R together. Now you'll have to type in temp and hit enter. If it asks you for permission just click on OK. You can click on Ctrl A to select all the files and then Ctrl D to delete them. After deleting those files you have to repeat the same procedure with other two commands. Click on Windows key and R and then type in the percentage sign and temp and again the percentage sign. Hit enter. Control A and Control D to delete them all. Repeat and then type in prefetch. And now you'll be asked for the permission just click on continue and repeat the same. Control A and Control D. You can skip those files which are in use right now just click on do this for our current items and then click on skip 6. To boost your performance you can clean your disk to clean your disk you'll have to click on this PC and then open it now you can see your drives over here you have to right click on the device and then click on properties over here there will be an option disk cleanup just click on it and then it 
you can select the options which you want to clean up and it will automatically clean your disk as you can see my disk has been cleaned right now and it is clean you can repeat it for other drives too fix 7 another easy way to keep your PC running smoothly is to uninstall softwares or applications which you don't require to do so you can go to your control panel and you can select each of the application and then click on uninstall or you can even go to the settings and then remove application and you can even do it from there let me show you so control panel and if you don't have it on your desktop you can use run to open it uninstall a program on the bottom and you can select those options which you don't want the application which you don't want just click on it and then hit uninstall to do it from your settings you'll have to click on apps and then go to install apps over here apps and features over here you can remove or delete those software or application which you don't require this can actually improve the performance of your PC to delete the software and application you'll have to just click these three dots over here and then hit uninstall if you're still watching the video here's a bonus for you there's an option over here called as gaming you can click on gaming and then game mode if you're a gamer or if you want to increase your performance and then there's a game mode over here which will optimize your PC which will automatically turn off the things in the background you can turn this on and this will actually improve your performance as you know this is not the full version of Windows 11 full version of Windows 11 is yet to be released hope this video would have helped you for more similar videos you can subscribe to our channel we'll meet in the next video till then peace out